All right, so after taking down the Gammas in the last video, it's time for the final boss, the final test, which of course is Cell Max. Now I am fully expecting this guy to be a uh, huge butthole and give me a lot of trouble, but we do have the double Piccolo still, so I think we got this. Now I will make one minor adjustment to this team, which is to uh, take out the LR God Goku and Vegeta in favor of, uh, let's see, in favor of the God uh, Goku, the tech God Goku, because of course we are facing now Cell Max, who is a movie boss's character, and as such, this guy will take literally no damage from Cell Max, in theory. So, yeah, that is the team. Uh, I'm not sure about including Beast Gohan, but I do want him to be there just because it's canon, you know? So that is the setup, and without further ado, I'm gonna jump in here and uh, hopefully defeat him in our first attempt. Okay, so we got the triple piccolo rotation here. Triple piccolo rotation, I like that. That is good. Um, Let's put the friend in the first slot, and yeah, I'm I'm gonna no item this first rotation. Uh, I I think I think it's gonna be okay, but it might not be okay. We're about to find out. We're about to find out. Okay, so uh, double digit tanking, obviously type advantage. I know this guy technically only has one phase but he also switches between different types as you go through the stage so that's gonna be something interesting to worry about for sure um can he be sealed i think the answer is no the answer is no okay the answer is no so he can't be sealed which i'm not surprised by um it would have been really nice if we could seal him but considering this is like the one phase oh god oh wow oh i thought we would take a lot more damage i mean even with the guard even with the guard i thought piccolo would take significantly more damage than that so that um is a nice surprise that's a very nice surprise okay uh now we're on the tech stage or the te uh, tech phase, I guess. Um, and uh, we are going to... Uh, let me think. You know what? It might actually be a good idea to put <laughs> or keep Pan in the first slot. She does have to have type, type advantage and she obviously can dodge. Um, which I think we are able to on this phase. He might cancel dodge. I'm not sure about that. We'll find out soon. Okay. That's interesting. That's interesting. Okay. Um, he might cancel dodge, or we just got unlucky. It's one or the other. I'm feeling like we got unlucky. Uh, I would say we'll we'll find out with Gogeta, but Gogeta has actually historically been really bad at dodging for me, so. That's also hard to say. Oh, we got a dodge. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. We got two dodges. We got two dodges. So it's definitely possible to dodge. We just didn't get very lucky, it would seem. Okay. Now we are on the int phase. Um, obviously, I could... Oh, wait. Never mind. We can't. Uh, I was going to say we can pop the active skill, but then I realized that... Uh, you need to have a full rotation of superheroes, which obviously this Piccolo is not, right? So that's a bit of a problem. Um, let me see how we're going to play this. Let's put the God Ku at the end. Okay, let's get an 18k super for this Piccolo, a super for this Piccolo, and then... Nice, we got the two uh, Rainbow Key Spheres for the Goku as well. Okay. 19 mil attacks that is kind of wild now hopefully it's a soup or sorry it's a it's a crit so we actually do some damage oh my god <laughs> that 
But that was perfect. That was perfect. That was beautiful. Okay. <clears throat> it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. I don't want to get over overly excited because obviously uh, we still got a long way to go. But we're off to a good start. That's for sure. We're off to a very good start. <clears throat> Taking a super here, 77% damage reduction results in 54 damage. So that's awesome. And then we got the Gogeta transformation. Um, I probably should pop the item here. I think that would be smart. I think that would be the smart thing to do. So I am going to pop a Whis here. Um, yeah, okay. And I'm going to leave uh, uh, Piccolo in the first slot to take all those hits, build up his passive, all that good stuff. Yep. Yep, do your thing. Uh-oh, okay. So this guy hasn't really had a chance to really build up too much, so ooh, he's fine. <laughs> so he's fine. 8.3 mil. Not too shabby. Not the most impressive, but not too shabby. Okay. Some solid damage. Oh wait, you know what? Actually, it looks like he's fully built up. It looks like he's fully built up. Uh, I don't remember him taking that many hits, but I guess he did. I guess he did take a lot of hits before. That I just forgot about. Because uh, he's fully built up now. Okay, that's great. And we're getting dodges. <laughs> and we're getting more dodges. And we're getting a third dodge. That's wild. The only thing that would have made this rotation better was if uh, Gogeta got the additional super, like he normally would, but it's fine. It's all good. Um, we still have the uh, Whis active Gohan. We're going to float because it just makes sense since he's, you know, kind of a liability. And honestly, only here because he's on theme, because... I like his active skill animation mostly. Uh, but yeah, these Piccolos are gonna put in some work here. And and Gohan, I mean offensively will do damage. It's just his defense is like very, very rough. Um Yo, I love the placement of <laughs> Piccolo's super attack too. It's like every single time. Every single time that blast goes right in the, you know, the man parts, and it's awesome. It's just like uh, it's just like LR, uh, Final Form Cooler, you know, like when he like punches the guy, the enemy, right, like uh, into into the into the ground, right. It's like always right in the, you know, right in the pee pee. I was trying to say like, trying to think of like the right thing to say that like wouldn't be considered too vulgar, I guess, you know, but uh, I guess that's not really a bad thing. You know, like I don't think I'll get in trouble from YouTube specifically. I don't, I don't know, you guys don't care, but I don't want YouTube to be on my case. So I, I think uh, I chose the right words. I think I chose the right words. Okay, so now we're back to um, the cell, the AGL cell max, right? We're just cycling through the, the, the types, AGL cell max now. And this is where I pop the uh, orange piccolo active skill. And I mean, I guess finish him off. I thought it would actually be a lot harder. I thought this guy would actually take a lot more or just have a lot more HP, right? But so far, he's going down quick, man. Unless like I missed something from the Dokkan Wiki because I did check it out. Um, that's how I knew that he switched forms, right? Or switched uh, types every turn. But up to this point, um, he, you know, has been kind of a pushover. I gotta be honest, man. I don't think I even needed the item. I don't think I even needed the Whis. That was more of just the insurance policy. But, like, if we didn't pop the Whis, we'd still be alive right now, for sure. And um, this could have easily been, like, a no-item run. Now, if I am missing something... Then maybe I should shut up because I could look really stupid if I somehow end up dying here. But I, I'm I'm pretty sure this is the only phase for Cell Max, and we are just we're crushing him right now, man. We're just destroying this guy. They 
they made Cell Max kind of a weenie. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. I mean, this this guy seems a lot easier than the uh <clears throat> the uh Cell Max event Cell Max, right? Like relatively speaking. Um Oh, what? Oh, is it because he's changing phases? So technically it's a new fight, but that would... St I feel like that should still not cancel our orange piccolo transformation. That's a little weird. <clears throat> That's a little strange. Well, anyways, um... Should still be fine, I think. Uh, maybe I should pop another Whis just for safety purposes. Let's pop another Whis. Yeah, you know what? It's not It's not worth the risk. It's not worth the risk. Okay. Um, but yeah, that was a little weird, man. We only got one turn of Orange Piccolo. I thought it was going to be two, three turns like normal, but I guess when he changes over from one form to the other, or one, same form, one type to the other, it cancels your transformations. Or at least like a giant form transformation, right? Because that's exactly what has happened, which is very strange. Oh, Gogeta is about to put in some work, man. Especially with an additional super here. Yo, come on. Give me additional super. Ah, damn it. Okay. Man, additional supers? Like, the additional super there would have been... Yeah, might have been over. Might have been over. Oh, what did I say about the placement of the special beam cannon? I'm telling you, like the special beam cannon always hits its target. It always hits the target. Uh. Ooh. Okay. See, this is not ideal. Like, I will pop it, but like now he's int, right? So unless we get some crits going here, we're really not gonna do much damage as Cell Max, but or as uh, Orange Piccolo. But at the same time. We are still able to not take any damage for one turn, at least, which is still, still, still a good thing. It's still very valuable. Okay, yeah, let's just try to get as much damage as we possibly can with this one turn of the friend cell max. Uh, we did see a lot of crits from him, so he obviously has quite a bit of crit on his in his hidden potential. So I am expecting a couple of crit supers here at least. Maybe multiple, maybe just finish him off. We don't have to worry about the next turn. Not that I'm concerned per se, but I am a little bit concerned about <laughs> uh, the pan, specifically, getting us killed. Oh, come on, man. Let me see some crits. Let, let me see some crits. Okay, this guy supers a lot. That That's one thing I've noticed now. He supers a lot. And it feels like... The, the further we get into the event, the more he supers. I don't know if that's a thing. I don't know if like they increase the chance of him supering or the, the rate he supers at. The further you get into the stage, but that's what it feels like so far. For sure. Okay, you gotta give me at least one crit, right? Like, all of these attacks, not a single crit. Come on. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Yeah, and there we go. We're back to normal, normal Piccolo. Okay, that's interesting. Well, um, definitely gonna put the uh power awaken Piccolo in that first slot. Um, oh shoot. Okay, this this could be bad. Well, okay, we'll do that. And then Pan hopefully just dodges that one attack, and it's not a super. That would be ideal. Or if this is a crit, actually, it still still could end things right here, right now. Mm-hmm, okay, okay. Yep, there's a super. This should do nothing. Yeah, 58. <laughs> Perfect. Um, we know STR Piccolo can 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 tank as well, so I wouldn't mind him taking a super either. It's really just Pan that can't take a super on this rotation, so 
Now that we got the two supers out of the way, I don't think he's going to super a third time. At least I hope, I pray, I pray that he doesn't super us again, because Pan cannot really take a hit unless she dodges first. If she dodges first, yeah, okay, there we go. Woo, all right, all right, we made it, we made it, and... Um, ooh, oh, 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 let's make it super cannon. Let's make it super cannon. Yo, if, if, if Beast Gohan can finish him off with this active skill attack right now, then we're basically just playing the end of the movie, right? Like, this is the reason I brought him onto this run. This is the main reason. You got to finish him off, man. He only has one bar of HP left. He has a single bar of HP left. If you can't finish him, then you are just sad. You are just sad. Okay, he's just sad. <laughs> Can't believe they did Beast Gohan like this, man. Can't believe they did Beast Gohan like that. Well, either way, it's still gonna be over. I just was really hoping that it would be the cell, I mean, uh, the, the Beast Gohan active skill that finishes it. It just would have been perfect. It just would have been, you know, the ideal ending, but what can you do, man? He just isn't good enough. <laughs> and this is, that's all I can really say. He's not good enough. Now you know who is good enough. Blue Gogeta. Blue Gogeta is very much good enough. So there you have it, guys. Cell Max done. Um, I used a couple items just to, you know, be safe. I don't think it was really super necessary, but for the purpose of the video, I wanted to make sure that we got it done first try. So uh that's that man you can definitely no item this with the piccolo uh even even though um he's not nearly as effective here as he is on some other events where you get the three to four turns or sorry two to three turns per piccolo of uh orange piccolo you know invulnerability but it's not a huge deal we still got it done so let me just grab my rewards there um oh, we got our wallpaper that's kind of dope hold on let me let me see what it looks like on the home screen here Okay, set, and uh, not bad, not bad. I'm not loving like the white bar at the bottom here. I wish it was just like extended a little bit further to like cover the the bottom buttons as well. But uh, as a whole, I think it looks pretty nice. I think it looks pretty nice. So there you have it, guys. That is the Cell Max. Um, you know, I was expecting a much bigger challenge. Like I said, I was expecting him to give me some problems and he really didn't he surprised me a little bit surprised me a little bit with all the supers and with um canceling the giant form for piccolo but outside of that uh that's pretty chill it's pretty chill they they nerfed the crap out of cell max i feel like with this stage uh the other cell max definitely still much much harder but Nonetheless, got it done. That's all that matters. Thank you guys for watching. As always, if you like today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Uh, of course, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. Uh, hit that subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. And that's it. Um, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.